Welcome to the Ithacan's recap of the early events concerning the COVID-19 virus. I will lead you through the major events that have happened from December 31st, 2019 up to January 31st, 2020. On December 31st, 2019, cases of pneumonia were detected in Wuhan, China and first reported to the World Health Organization. During this reported period, the virus was unknown. On January 7, 2020, Chinese authorities confirmed that they have identified the virus as a novel coronavirus. On January 11, 2020, the Wuhan Municipal Health Commission announced the first death caused by the coronavirus. A 61-year-old man exposed to the virus at a seafood market died on January 9th after respiratory failure caused by severe pneumonia. On January 17th, Chinese health officials confirmed that a second person had died in China. The U.S. responded to the outbreak by implementing screenings for symptoms at airports in San Francisco, New York, and Los Angeles. January 20th, the National Institutes of Health announced that they were working on a vaccine against the coronavirus. January 21st, officials in Washington state confirmed the first case of coronavirus on U.S. soil. January 29th, the White House announced the formation of a new task force that will help monitor and contain the spread of the virus and ensure Americans have accurate and up-to-date health and travel information. On January 30th, the U.S. reported its first confirmed case of person-to-person -person transmission of the Wuhan coronavirus. On the same day, the World Health Organization determined that the outbreak constituted a public health emergency of international concern. On January 31st, the Donald Trump administration announced that it will deny entry to foreign nationals who have traveled to China in the last 14 days. As events continue to develop, follow the Ithacan as we put up more updates. A part two of this video will come out soon.